With Color 1.5, you'll be able to grade and output 4K RED files at pristine quality. With full 4K RED RAW resolution, you'll have incredible latitude to control the look of your video. Use the RED RAW fine tuning controls to adjust exposure, increase contrast, and brighten your images. And because you're working with a camera RAW file, you'll be able to adjust the video with incredible depth and precision, all without losing quality or adding unwanted artifacts. When grading is complete, Color 1.5 will output in beautiful, full-resolution 4K, ideal for creating film prints or digital cinema files for projection. Take advantage of the incredible quality of RED footage with the power of Color 1.5, part of the new Final Cut Studio. Thanks to improved sequence compatibility and tighter integration, you'll be able to move seamlessly between Final Cut Pro and Color, giving you more time to focus on creating the perfect grade and finishing your work. Working with Color is easy. Simply select a Final Cut Pro sequence and use the Send To command. The sequence is transferred to Color with all of its edits in place, even freeze frames, speed effects, multicam, and other advanced functions. Use color to perform primary grades and secondary adjustments such as vignetting to fine-tune your image. Then, under the Geometry tab, you can adjust framing. And finally, add some color effects. When you're finished, you can export video in a variety of formats, including DPX for film and digital cinema workflows, or simply select the Send To command to send it back to Final Cut Pro. A copy of your finished sequence is created with all of the graded shots in place. With improved compatibility and tighter integration, it's easier than ever to grade and output your video with the new Final Cut Studio. Compressor 3.5 lets you create and burn Blu-ray discs and standard definition DVDs with simple, interactive menus. Get started quickly using Apple Design templates featuring beautiful HD menus. You can add chapter markers in Compressor or import them from Final Cut Pro. Add graphics and logos and even create your own titles. The on-screen preview lets you see how your finished disc will look before burning. Create custom menu templates with your own backgrounds and artwork, and then save them for easy, one-click access anytime. Compressor 3.5 lets you quickly produce professional-looking SD and HD discs with simple interactive menus for your movies. Compressor 3.5 gives you a complete set of encoding tools to publish your video virtually anywhere. Just choose a new setting from the Settings tab. Choices include Apple devices, many HD, SD, and web formats. Then, customize other parameters including frame rate and audio settings. You can use filters to add animated watermarks, apply basic color adjustments, and control contrast. Even add time code and text overlays to your video. Use the cropping tool to automatically remove black bars or change output dimensions. Then you can save your custom settings, and they'll appear under the new Share menus in Final Cut Pro and Motion. Sharing your videos in any format is simpler than ever, thanks to the tight integration between Compressor 3.5 and Final Cut Pro. Soundtrack Pro 3 includes professional tools for stretching and compressing audio, so you can fit audio precisely where you need it. Introducing the Specialized Tarmac. I am specialized. The Audio Stretching tool lets you manipulate audio visually in the file editor, making it easy to adjust your recordings in relation to other parts of your mix. Introducing the Specialized Tarmac. I am specialized. For even more precision, use the Time Stretch window to set a specific duration or percentage change for the Time Stretch effect. Choose from powerful built-in stretching engines for different types of audio material, or access user-installed third-party algorithms directly inside Soundtrack Pro. Best of all, 
Time stretching is completely non-destructive, so you can modify your changes at any time. Just double click in the actions list and enter a new value. The time stretch will immediately update with your changes. Stretch and compress audio with incredible precision in Soundtrack Pro 3. Soundtrack Pro 3 is the ideal tool for repairing audio files that have undesirable background noise or other problems. Hey, how was your commute? This clip has a couple of digital clicks in it. The Analysis tab lets you quickly remove common problems like clicks, pops, and power line hum. Soundtrack Pro analyzes the problem and fixes it automatically. Hey, how was your commute? Soundtrack Pro features a dedicated tool for removing background noise. Hey, how was your commute? Like air conditioners, wind, and other audio problems. Just set a noise print from a small sample of the background noise, and then selectively dial it out of the entire recording. Hey, how was your commute? Hey, how was your commute? Hey, how was your commute? Hey. How is your commute? Rescue audio that would otherwise be lost or unusable with the powerful restoration tools in Soundtrack Pro 3. Hey, how is your commute? Instantly spot audio to picture using the powerful spotting tools in Soundtrack Pro 3. For example, this shot needs a sound effect for the zipper. To start, just position the playhead where you want to add a clip. Choose a clip from the library, bin, or browser, and then select Spot to Playhead. The new audio drops into your sequence exactly where you need it. Soundtrack Pro also helps you line up sound effects or dialogue. You can use the multipoint video HUD to quickly spot them to your video. To sync the sound effect with the gear shift, Simply select the exact point in the sound by clicking the mouse. When you do, you'll see the frames of video that line up with the start and end of the clip. The center frame shows the video at the point that you clicked in the sound. You can quickly move the sound to match them up precisely. Let go of the mouse and play it back in perfect sync the very first time. Whether you're working with time-stamped audio or building a soundtrack from scratch, the powerful spotting tools in Soundtrack Pro make it fast and easy. The secondary tools in color let you adjust and enhance specific parts of the image, helping you to focus the viewer's attention exactly where you want it. You can apply up to eight secondary effects using vignettes and custom drawn masks. You can control adjustments to both the inside and outside of the vignette. You can even track the on-screen movement so the effect happens precisely where you want it. Use secondary tools to relight a scene, change the color of the sky, or correct skin tones. Create compelling and unique looks with the powerful secondary controls in Color 1.5. Perform global adjustments on an entire image at once with the primary grading tools in Color. All primary adjustment tools are easy to access in a single window. Use Auto Balance to dramatically increase image quality, like when a shot is too bright or washed out. Then you can refine the adjustments even further. With separate color wheels for shadows, midtones, and highlights, you can adjust different aspects of your image. Manually control the saturation, lift, gain, and gamma. Or for even finer control, curves allow you to adjust specific channels with precision. And because you can apply up to four grades per clip and switch between them, you can work interactively with a client, quickly showing them how different adjustments can affect the clip. The primary adjustments in Color 1.5 give you total control over your video for amazing results. With Final Cut Pro 7, you can customize your interface exactly how you'd like with just a few clicks. From the Window menu, you can select from screen layouts that are optimized for specific tasks like audio mixing, color correcting, and editing. 
or you can adjust your window layout until it's exactly how you need it. And then save it as a custom layout. Within the windows themselves, you can open bins and then add their tabs to the browser window, complete with their label colors. This lets you set up the interface exactly the way you want it. And now with Final Cut Pro 7, you can rearrange tabs too. Just drag them to a new position. The keyboard is also fully customizable. Just search for the function that you want to assign to a key, then drag and drop it. You can even add buttons to the interface. Simply drag a command from the button list and drop it onto the button bars. If you're like most editors, you work on multiple systems. Once everything is set up perfectly, you can save your layout files and load them onto another system, so all your settings stay the same wherever you go. Customizing your interface is easier than ever with Final Cut Pro 7.